come down, then you subtract one from the power. So if this one comes down from your first rule, that if you have ax to the power n, the n will come down. So this 5 will come down first of all. So you have 5 times, then subtract one from this power, you have this. 5 minus 4 is, 5 minus 1 is 4, then lin x. But that's not all. When you differentiate your sine function, you are supposed to have cos. When you differentiate your sine function, so you have cos. But what is inside this sine is your lin x. And don't also forget that this thing inside this function, you have to still differentiate it. Now, when you differentiate lin x, you will obtain 1 over x. So your final answer becomes 5 sine 4 lin x, then cos lin x all over x. Or let's focus.